Oh, keep going with that idea. <laughs> I, don't, I liked it. I liked it. <laughs> oh! Uh huh. Uh -huh. Now, where do you see the evolution of this idea? And, uh, it's and it's every day. <laughs> oh, okay, there it is. Are we harmonizing now? I'll be my. Uh... Uh... No? Oh! Nice harmonizing, everybody. What's up? <laughs> Welcome. We're doing boxu today because Good what day? Like, what what month? What month is it? December. It is December. This is last month. I just wanted to throw you under the bus there because you couldn't do days. Oh, really? What a cow's drink. Silk. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it, got him. Uh, this we have to say from Danny Tang. Thank yeah. you. Is the nicest boxu box ever ever got. It's so classy. It's like, inverted. It us it's usually uh, orange with a white trim, and now it's white with an orange trim and a nice, beautiful uh, maru. Oh, golden oh! maru. Oh, pulling out culture. It's the golden maru. Nice. Okay, one thing I'm going to do today. Okay, we've literally forgotten to do it every single box zoo yeah, we've yeah. ever oh, done. God, sorry. We no haven't one, said itadakimasu no, no. before eating the first bite, which what? is maybe not. Like, I don't know. But it's illegal. I know, right? It's basically illegal. We should be arrested. Oh, we have to show Spubby's oh, big waffle because we forgot Boom! to, apparently. But, 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 but we the bigger, golder waffle. The bigger, golder waffle. Whoa, shaking the desk. Whoa! No, like there's hot water here. And I did do it. I did do it. Um, can, and I, oh. can, can you show that compared to a normal waffle? It's bigger, and then I'm actually gonna make it even bigger. I was gonna say, I was gonna yeah. say, we're still, uh, we're right, still, yeah. we're still adjusting sizes, and I personally think it needs to be a little yeah. bigger. Right now, I think it's about thirty percent bigger than the other one, but it's gonna go to at least fifty percent bigger. bigger. <gasps> what is that? A bigger golder waffle for ants? <laughs> yeah, exactly, exactly. Oh, um, funny fact uh, before we start. Um, the first time I heard Bohemian Rhapsody was from Wayne's World. First time yeah. you ever heard it. Yeah, I know. I, I, that was my first exposure right? to it as well. I know. Crazy how that works. Uh, yeah, I was, I was listening to Gus, and Gus was saying that, or uh, like he said, a whole video on music copyright. Mm -hmm. And he was saying that apparently some people are like pretending to hear uh, Bohemian Rhapsody for the very first time. Why? Because the movie came out and stuff, and it's oh. trending. And so he did a video on it. You can watch that. I haven't seen it yet, but he was talking about that yeah. video. Yeah. Uh, and then I was like, when the hell did I hear Bohemian Rhapsody the first time? And then all, all I could think of was Mike Myers. And uh, oh, I can't remember the other guy's name, but yeah. Dane. Oh, oh, Dane, Dane, right? No. No? No. Oh. Dana. 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 Yeah. Dana. Yeah. Harvey. But them just rocking in the car, man. It's such an unforgettable scene. I love that so much. Just Wayne and Garth and their yeah. two friends in the back. Oh no, three friends in the back. Because they had the one small guy in the middle <laughs> who was so wasted. And it's like, yeah. if you're gonna hurl, hurl, hurl into, into this. this. And it's like a little cup. Yeah, oh. <laughs> it's so good. Anyways, we'll talk more about that later. I just not hurling, just uh, about boxing yeah, today. I couldn't, uh, <laughs> I couldn't keep that in. All right. But, yeah. You and, okay. You, 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 you pull the top off, and hold I'll hold the bottom. Well, let's that. bring it a bit closer. Before we do that, da 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 a Douglas. A Douglas. Thank you. Um, you're gonna have to let us know what. Oh, there it is. is. You get both. Yay! Hey! Thank you, A Douglas. Some, a Douglas. Things, some things have been. Uh, oh, Streamlabs is having difficulties with uh, YouTube's new thingy. Uh, so let us know which tier that is, and we will get waffles you. given away. There we are. Cool. We need to know for the waffles. Okay, now. Because this is how nice it looks here, and we already showed how pretty it looks here. So fine, why don't you? I'll hold it like this, and you pull it off the top, okay? It's working. It's working really well. Wow! Oh, it's so pockets. winter. Very winter. It's I beautiful. Like it is, oh my goodness! Wow. And then you know what? That is. I don't know if this is a brand new thing they just Hide added. Your face tongue. Or not? Mm. Look at how pretty that is. My oh, God. It's this is so nice. Oh, my God. Uh, but We need to go there. But I want to go there. I want to be there. They added happy snacking on the oh, inside. Oh, that's nice. I happy know. snacking. Yeah. These boxes are so good. Yeah, they're I, great. We use them for everything. You I'm going to use them for gifts this year. I was thinking you should put like your gifts in them. Oh, my my little great. brother, I, I I gave him a gift in a boxy box, and I went and he has it my mounted in his room. Not mounted, but he has it sitting on like a thing in his room as a yeah. decoration. Thanks, Dick Douglas. Nice. It's the one of us. Nice. Wanna... Oh, nice. Boop, boop. Let me get And uh, if uh, if you guys want to uh, get in on your own box suit, Yan5 is the code. Yep. There should be a link in the description down yep. below. They're freaking mm -hmm. delicious and awesome, yes. and I'll tell you why. Uh, so let's start off with our... our our lovely letter from from Danny Tang every time. Oh hi, Danny. It kind of feels like we have a pen pal that we never write to. I know, right? Oh man. 
Just instead of happy snacking, Danny changes it to please reply. <laughs> please reply at the end. Just, please reply. The Nyan Cave never writes back. back. All the other people write back, back. but never the Nyan, Nyan Cave. <laughs> Thank you for being a spirited Boxu member. Are you ready to experience winter in Japan? Whether you get meters of snow or have never seen a flake, I hope you enjoy this month's hand-selected curation of winter snacks and teas packed in our, our newly custom-designed classic boxu. This beautiful and limited edition white box design is only available during the holidays for December and January boxu, oh, so wow. consider gifting them to loved ones before they sell out. Winky face. You know Winky I kind of want to order like a lot and then just have a bunch of these boxes because they're really nice. Oh, uh, that's pretty funny, actually. Happy snacking! Please reply. Please Danny Tang, founder. <laughs> if you're watching Danny, hi. Hi. Yeah, hi, 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 Danny. and thank you. Thank you. How's the okay. wife? Hey, yeah, I'm have, just kidding. Have... Do you have a wife? Are you two dudes? Are you single? Are you looking? I am. Hey, hey, oh. No, I'm, not, I'm the... not ready for a relationship. Wow, that escalated quickly. <laughs> <laughs> I, can't... Already, I, think, already I was going to say, I think favorite. we just did the full circle of relationship. Yeah. I can't believe you just dated and broke up with Danny. <laughs> My God. <laughs> okay, where's the tea? Shido Boxu. <laughs> Can you um, find me the tea? Oh, there is no tea. Okay. There's a Hoshino Hojicha Latte. Uh, a shift from the more commonly known hojicha, we bring you Hoshino Hojicha Latte, an instant latte that can be enjoyed both hot or cold. An ideal progression for hojicha due to its nutty caramel flavor. Okay. Grab a cup and enjoy, and keep you warm this winter. Uh, empty the packet in your cup, pour 120 to 150 milliliters of hot water over the powder. Water. That is not a lot of hot water, right? Uh, stir well with a spoon and enjoy. Oh, we don't have a spoon. So and I think that's too much oh, water. I think that, that's uh, okay. I'll do mine with a little, uh, what, 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 a little extra water. Fine. I'll just, I'll take, I'll pour some out. I'll pour some out. Can you, can you pull the top of the nail off? Not to you. I don't feel safe doing this. Thank you. Yeah, that'd be okay. That is very scary. Yes, this has, this has, uh, common allergens. Milk. So it might taste nutty, but apparently there are no nuts in it. Nice. Okay, so I popped it open. Oh yeah, it smells. Uh... Ooh, that does smell nutty. <laughs> Did your like sister ever make you snort pixie sticks before? No. no. Yeah, my, uh, peer you know. pressure in high school. Did, yeah, but I didn't. I not. was. I know. I, they were like, yeah, we're we're gonna snort pixie sticks. It's like that is the stupidest thing You're I've dumb. ever heard. Uh, Why would for, you do that? We were dumb high school kids. I, no, it was middle school for me. Oh. Yeah. Oh my God, you grew up on the rough side. I, I know. Right? I was like nine. Wow. My sister was like, this is a good idea, and I just, wanted, part her of to, town. I just wanted her to like me. Yeah. Uh, for, for future reference, you, you know what? Just don't snort anything don't. unless your doctor tells you to. And the doctor would never tell you to. I don't think You're, so. There's, there's better ways a, to it. I don't think that's how you administer any medications ever. None. None. I, I don't know. They told me to do something with medication that I thought they'd never tell me to do. <laughs> I'm not going to go into that, but doctors might surprise you. <laughs> Okay. Make sure he's a real doctor. If you're real doctor, anyways, we're off of a You know what he could have done made this way easier is just pouring them both into one. Oh, and then we could have uh, indirect kissed. Indirect kisu. Oh, I was like, what did you do with the extra water? So. Dude, kids at our school did smarties. God damn it. You guys are monsters. <laughs> oh, God. All right, well, I'm going to read. Yeah. Uh, the snow festival. Mm -hmm. Happy holidays. Thanks. Winter in Japan always makes us think of the northern prefectures blanketed in a fluffy white snow. With temperatures dropping, it's becoming that time of year to enjoy a hot cup of tea and more importantly, check out Japan's most famous Yuki Matsuri snow festivals. Our curation this month is inspired by these snow festivals featuring snacks as light as snow like milk mochi and mm. snow mimosa as well as flavored with uh, as well as Flavored, okay, yeah. As well as flavored with ingredients from the northern prefectures like Hokkaido. Held in cities across northern Japan, snow festivals have become iconic events of the season, featuring incredible ice sculptures, live performances, and yatai, which are food stalls, uh, selling local foods. If you don't get a chance to attend a snow festival in Japan this winter, fear not, because we are bringing the snow festival to you oh, with nice. December Boksu. That's okay. sweet. That's so sweet. Now, we can try these lattes. First thing on the list. Uh, oh, we're latte? Right, latte. Latte's latte. the first thing on the list? Latte, yeah. Okay. Technically, it's the last uh, thing on the list, but I just want to get it. Oh, latte. It, it, doesn't, it doesn't smell sweet. Oh, latte. Wow, though. Mm. It is. It doesn't smell sweet. Like, but it's what nice. a sweet smell like for a drink. That's I, really delicious. Yeah, I think there might be a little too much water in it. Mm, but it's actually... Give that a try. Give that, maybe, mine had maybe a little less water than yours. Certainly did. Ah, it's about the same. 
<clears throat> yeah, it's, it's a little thin, but it's very silky smooth. Uh, yeah. it's, it's a little nutty. It's uh, As far uh, as yeah. drinks go, how would you rate it out of 10? Um, mm. You know... Oh, yeah. And Yanni, have a, have a silly sip. Of... It leaves me a little wanting. <laughs> um, Maybe but caramel. yeah, nutty, nutty caramel. Nyan head, Nyan head. Um, uh, oh no! I, 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 you go on. Tell, you you say yours. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go. With, I'm gonna go with a six point five. <laughs> Out of ten for a drink of a latte type thing. I had a very bold cup of coffee this morning though, so that might have that might have skewed me a little bit. It's delightful. Uh, it's um, delightful. It's you, delightful. Uh, so uh, a six point five. I'm giving it a seven. I'm giving it a 7.5. Wait, wait. I just keep wanting to drink it. I got to move to an 8 for me. I have to. I just had to because I got to oh, keep wow. sipping on wow. it. Wow. Because again, now, now I want to say, I just want, we got to say a little bit about our, our scores course, a little of bit. Of course, of course. Is that I'm giving it an 8 because uh, we're rating this specifically on drinks and specifically on like lattes and things like that. And I'm putting it into a category like, of instant lattes. Yeah, if you, if you put in the instant lattes, like, yeah, maybe not. it's a very high quality instant latte. It's a latte. very, like, very tasty. But, it's so tasty. But and like, like, I just keep I'm a latte wanting, snob. Yeah, exactly. And I keep wanting to drink it. So I'm going to leave it at an eight for myself. Uh, because if if I were to, like, have this in my in my cupboard, I would go back to it consistently. That's what I'm saying. I just haven't been feeling hot drinks recently. I don't know. Maybe. I don't know. It's fine. Mm. Well, mm. we're gonna move on yeah, to this. To Wario's waifu! Guess who just graduated co from college yesterday? Oh, yeah! Yeah! Oh, Yo, Wario's waifu, congratulations! I hugely appreciate the support, and uh, that's, a, that's a big step. Anyway, uh, thanks for the great year, guys. Aww. This channel got me through senior year, so I wanted to show my appreciation. Oh, thank you. And, and you got yourself through senior yeah. year. You know, we were just along yeah. for the ride. Yeah. Hey, we you know, and even so, <laughs> if we want to take the, as much credit as we could take, like as we could even possibly take, you still had to open us up on your phone, and you did that. Yeah. Bam, Wario's. I like you. how the vast majority of our chat's more educated than us. <laughs> yes. Ah, okay. We didn't need our to say chat that is smarter than us. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man! Was it ever really a doubt, though? <laughs> no. Our chat teaches us thing all the time, and I teach them about uh, the uterus. It's the way that I give back. Yeah. You know? And uh, the next item, please, for a segue. <laughs> <laughs> uh, sake bushimaru. Uh, sa damn it! Oh, we haven't eaten yet. Don't forget. Don't forget, Nanny. Don't okay. you forget. I won't. Uh, salmon senbei. Uh, this is from a product of Hokkaido. Hokkaido, um, by Ryugetsu. Um, Ryugetsu. Uh, also contains mollusk, self, uh, shellfish, and alcohol. Mollusk? Ooh. So a mollusk and a sea cucumber walk into a bar. Yeah. I don't remember the rest of the joke, but it's from Finding Nemo. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Reminiscent of a delicious meal of freshly cooked salmon over rice, this snack will keep you full of flavor and fun. With a slight kick of pepper, this crunchy senbei is making its feature debut outside of Hokkaido for the first time ever through Boxu. So this is a sake, bu uh, sake bushimaru salmon senbei. senbei. Okay, now yeah. I just gotta say that, that's like, a long thing. I'm just gonna do yeah. salmon senbei instead. Yeah, yeah. That's uh, it is pungent. Pretty. Woo wee woo. It smells like, like the ocean. It smells like the ocean. It does actually smell like, and I don't like to uh, say it this way, but it does smell like fish food to me. Isn't it weird that we feed fish fish? Shayan says, it's going to linger in your mouth. It's going to linger oh, in your I mouth. Know. <laughs> Do you think they said it like that, though? It's going to linger. It's going to linger. You know, once you get used to it, though, it's actually, uh, yeah, I think it also, it's like, quite nice. Yeah, it chills out, but... I believe the term is pungent, though. I think I can smell it from here. Probably. I'm just gonna fan it a little bit at you. That's gonna do it. <sighs> Nothing? No? I'm just, I'm waving a freaking <laughs> fish a, fish, a dead fish at you. A literal fish cracker through the air right now. Head up! Please, please don't explode it everywhere. Can you do a little oh, sawing God. action? Oh no. I hunger. Does it smell for you now? No. Oh, I okay. just, I, I concern for your fingers. But I've never cut my finger off, so how could there be any danger? That's not how danger works. Yeah, sure. But the knife is really close to his fingers. You know what they say, the closer the danger, the farther you are from harm. Yeah, that that is uh, only relevant for hobbitses. <laughs> Was okay. the, did that come from that? Yes. I thought that so, was just a general thing. No, it's it's uh, Pippin. 
Pippin. He says, "Only? Oh, let's walk us down this way." And uh, he says, and then Mary's like, "But that's towards Isengard." And he's all like, "Yes, the closer we are to danger, the further we are from harm." I thought yeah. that. Uh, and then you can uh, whoever wants a little more. I just wanted a little bite. I'm not a big fish person. I thought that uh, Lord of the Rings was actually criticized for using like uh, oh, modern day goodness, modern this day sayings. Has a smell to it. Yeah. Uh, eat oh, the eat the eat the lucky Oh. Oh no, I put the whole thing in my mouth. It means a lot. Oh no, I am. Um... Hmm. Hmm. Uh -huh. So. A lot better than that would be. It is. It's le it's actually less fishy than it smells. Mm hmm. Um. Okay. It's got a nice crunch. Good I'll, texture. I've, I've said it before. I'm not the hugest fan of fish. Nor am I. So to put it's all just that. like a, a tier two fish. Um, I like thing. it. Mm hmm. Well, so, let's just drink this water. Yeah, I, I mean, if you, if you like, um, like uh, those like seaweed snacks and stuff, you'd like this. It, it tastes uh, a bit like seaweed, a bit like seafood, um, but like higher quality than those like seaweed snacks and stuff. Mm -hmm. um, um, so as far as far as seafood snacks go, it's pretty tasty. Yeah, a fish out of ten. What about you, Clay? Yeah. Um, I will give it. Yeah. I'll give it a seven. No. I enjoy the experience, yeah. but I don't think it's something I eat on a regular basis. But yeah. I feel like I could get used to it. You know? Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna give it a, a four out of ten cool. for myself because uh, I'm. But that's all based on the fact that it's a fish treat. And I'm not a fish person. Right, me too. That's it. As simple as that. I like your uh, fish out of wow. ten. Uh, so I picked four shot. Of, can I go four shot of ten? Absolutely. Hey, Ravens Fallon. Thank you so, so much. I just found out I got two associate degrees by accident. Oh! Accidental. <laughs> <laughs> accidentally Degree degrees. Highs. Degrees by association. Oh. Congrats. <gasps> I knew it. Oh I knew my it. God. I, knew it. I saw it happening. I felt it. Oh, I got to stop this. Uh, I'm holding all the electronics. I got the thing. Uh, can I get an exclamation, exclamation point, uh, Tom? And no. I've been so Tom. good for so long. Exclamation point, Tom, in chat, please. There we go. Mm, yeah. Oh, Tim. I should get a Tim in there. There we go. I'm going to change water to just his drink. I think that makes more sense. Yeah, I guess it does. Oh, man. Oh, I was really looking forward to it. This is my hochi latte. No. Hojicha. Mm. I wonder if it has caffeine in it. Oh, oh, geez. Yeah, putting the whole thing down there. Yeah, let me lay a little more over here. Oh, geez. Oh, geez. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, gosh. All the cut. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. Oh, oh, jeez. Oh, gosh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Valentina. No, I feel you, Tom. My hands are just all over the place. They're everywhere, right? Valentina knows. El Italiano handles. Strike again. <laughs> okay. Sounded like a space bandito. Hmm? Sounded like a space bandito. Oh, I was just reading what Zero wrote. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. But I could be a space bandito. If you want me space to. Space bandito, man. Put your hands up. I am space bandito. Okay. I want to change this. Want okay, to everybody. Well. I think it's time to move on. Yeah. We're going to have to get oh, that little so Lysol cool. wiped down pretty quick. You know what? That great, great uh, sealant. Good tabletop here. Thanks. Use one more layer. <laughs> Okay. We, we should have like a little uh, splash screen for like when these things happen. Oh, the splash Technical difficulties, Dan. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, if anyone wants to draw like silly art of, of Tom spilling something all over his desk and frantically cleaning it up, that would um, be good. We could we totally just put like, on black up screen. the screen. Boom. Um, Green Ghoul Guy says, You're fine, sweetie. I accidentally spilled coffee down my whole front earlier while I was candle carving. It Wait. was just a real moment. Damn. That's a really specific. I wasn't too hot. <laughs> It was a candle green play. Guy there, um, it's got to be oh. hot to carve it. Don't be ridiculous. The coffee needs to be hot. <laughs> Buttered <laughs> potato rice crackers. Joke. Uh, which one does it look like? This? Uh, it looks like butter potato rice crackers. I think this looks like a butter potato rice cracker to me. Yeah, you're you're, you're right. Nice. Bam. From the Kifu P uh, Prefecture. Also the name right, like me. Uh, using 100% Japanese domestic mochi rice. These arare, uh, this arare is sprinkled with buttered potato seasoning. That's really hard for me to do, by the way. Arare. 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 
This arare is sprinkled with butter potato seasoning, perfect for a cold winter's day. It has the rich flavor of comfort food. Arare me literally means hail because of their shape and the shape distinguishes them from other senbei. This arare, 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 reminds us of little winter you can just throw snowballs. Throw that one this way. Don't even open it. I can. I can open it. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Thank you. No worries. Roll that R's. I actually, Valentina, am incapable of rolling my R's. Yeah. Cheers. Oh. Hmm. Oh my god. Mm, that's so good. Oh my god. Mm, it's like the most amazing popcorn ever. I would eat all of this. Oh, oh is goodness. that like wait, wait, a little more like mm. tartness? Like, it's mm. like salted butter. Mm. Mm. They should serve that at movie theaters and I would pay like $20 oh for a bag. God. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's, oh my god. I don't want to give it a 10 because mm. what if there's something better? But this time? Mm. Yeah, infinite mm. void. It's only to stop Tom from using the knife. Stop that! Just, just stop. <laughs> Literally stop. I hate you so. Like, <laughs> you're not allowed to do that shit. Like, I'm, I'm gonna give it a nine point five, but it could go up to a ten if at the end there's nothing better than that because that is really good. Mm. See, I really, I like it a lot. I'm gonna give it uh, on that uh, an eight point five. Oh my! I'm going with eight point five. Yeah, no, ugh. that that is like an ideal snack food. Mm. Like so dangerously light. ideal. Mm. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll go 9.5. Wow. wow. Okay. And with a patented. The fuck? Sorry, I didn't mean to say that, but. <laughs> I'll give it the nut award. Oh. The nut award so yeah. far goes to. I like that. I like that. Um. Yeah. No, I think I think it was I think it was good. That's uh, it was tasty. It mm. was everything you said it was. 8.5. Oh, don't, don't do that. Don't, no, not you. You're fine. Sorry. Ginger, full metal ginger can do that with a knife really fast. The oh, thing. Nope, nope, nope. Don't, don't, don't do that. No, no, don't, don't, Tom. Fran double chocolate. What was two, that? two layers of what? Cran? Fran. Fran? Fran is in like, it's like bunny what? girl double chocolate. What? From Tokyo oh, by Meiji. My two layers of thick, rich, dark, chocolate cover a chocolate biscuit making this treat truly a triple threat fun as a wand for kids or a coffee stir for the more serious you'll oh. keep crunching on this smooth criminal until they're completely run out in the bag oh boy if i sit here with my mouth open do you think he'd like get one in i no man oh, you, you man. can't you can't mishandle uh stuff like that no uh, so they came with three packs of what appears to be four But they're designed, you wow. don't need to open them with a knife. Are you sure? Yeah. Now it's a clean cut, though. Yeah. Okay. Oh, no, it's not. It's perfect friendship. There are three. Wow. Those are thick. Whoop. Thanks. There you go. Thank wow. That's thick. I didn't expect this thick, but here it is. Here you go. Tom Look at how thick one. that is. He's dumb. Can you hold up your, like, pinky in comparison to that? That. It's like a pinky size almost. Literally, like pretty much pinky size. I didn't realize how crooked my pinkies are. No, oh, those man. are really crooked pinkies. I have some crooked ass fingers, what? yo. Okay, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna take a bite on yeah. some. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. It's dark chocolate. Oh, it's dark chocolate. Mm. Very nice. Mm. Oh, man. That is lovely. I'm not usually a fan of dark chocolate. I'm gonna stir it too. I would. <laughs> Next I'm time, stir I guess. Yours, yeah. Mmm. Mm. Wow. That's really good. It's so much better. Oh, it's like a little melty and crunchy on the inside. Mm. Okay. This is getting a nine. It sounds good too. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. I agree. It's a nine. Mmm. Mm. Mm. Now, 
I'm a uh, bit more of a sweet guy. Ooh, I, I've, uh, I think we've had those Shan from uh, mm. in a previous box too. So good. Mm. Oh, okay. Mm. 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 So I'm giving this a uh, mm, 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 mm. an eight. Okay, I'm giving this an mm. eight because mm -hmm. it was tasty, but I'm more of a fan of not oh. dark chocolate. Oh, I love. So it, it was a dark. little. It's like it's sweet. It's nice, but it wasn't. It wasn't level nine. Mm. It wasn't level nine for me. Mm. No, it's so good. It's dark. Mm. It's got that little bit of bitterness afterwards. Mm, mm, where, like, mm. I'm sure if you had tea, you'd have a sip of the tea, and it would just be like, ooh. Mm. 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 Yeah, I feel like it would. If I could have it with a latte, I'm sure it would be better. That was actually. quite lovely. <laughs> <laughs> Handmade Mikan Kandi. Oh, we should save this for the end. Oh, right. Right. And they're probably the ones you have to suck on. Oh, my God, and they're adorable. Oh, adorable. Oh, they're that? just little blocks. But they're squares. <laughs> Okay, these are handmade for Boxu specifically, and they're awesome. They're, they're always, always good. We'll come so back. Good. To we'll those. come back to those. Snow Mimosa from Hokkaido by Bon Bon Seika. Uh, from the same makers who created White Raspberry comes another delicious cookie. <gasps> Snow Mimosa. This snack gets its name from the cheddar cheese sprinkled on top, which looks like mimosa flowers lying on a plane of white chocolate, which is the snow. Uh, the base of this biscuit is an airy, crisp rye cookie coated with white chocolate and sprinkled with Hokkaido cheddar cheese. Oh, the cheese adds a bright, salty note to this sweet treat. And while we're waiting for that to be divvied. Oh, oh Riku! Fun food fact. Did you know that dark chocolate is more healthier for you oh. and is more pure chocolate? Yep, uh, I totally I, I believe, do believe that. Look at this. There's um, not much to add. There's not, not, not much added. So basically, like, there's two ends of the spectrum. On one of the spectrum is white chocolate, which actually doesn't even have cocoa in it. No. Right? Can which it? is... Oh, never mind. I'm not even going to continue. Just go. Chocolate. Um, mm -hmm. And then on the other end, you have, like, pure dark chocolate, like, just pure cocoa, right? And you can get cocoa powder. It's actually a, a great source of fiber. <laughs> um, and you can use it in uh, some of your cooking if you like. Um, and it's really good. Um, although it's dry, it's very dry, and it's actually quite bitter, yeah. um, which is why the, the, when mixed with sugar, it's pretty good. And then somewhere in the middle, you have milk chocolate. Oh, sorry, not milk chocolate. Yeah, milk chocolate, not white chocolate. Thirteen secrets of dark chocolate. Mm. Okay, I'm a huge have fan. Have you shown of the lovely cheese. people at home? I did. I showed them the inside of it. I showed them the top of it. I showed them the bottom of it, the sides of it, and mm. like it's got such a nice cheese smell to it. It does. It smells really cheesy. It smells like... It smells it's really cheesy. Party. Oh, man. Oh. Oh. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, my oh. God. See? That's the thing. It's, it's like, so delicate. It is so, so nice. delicate. Mm. It flaked away mm. um, and just oh. kind of like evaporated into like beautiful flavor. It wasn't overpowering on the cheese, no. which actually can be like sometimes a detriment. But it has that like it. buttery, like savory yeah. mm -hmm, mm -hmm. flavor to it. My God! And then hits you with that sweetness right Ooh. the way through. This is also a nine for me. Mmm. Mmm. I See, really like. You know crap. what? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Mmm. Man, I gotta change the the butt potato. Wait, why is it butt potato? Butter. Oh, okay. Uh, I gotta change that to a nine. And a nut, and, and this one, this one, because they added the chocolate, and it made it just like a little bit better. Um, this is the 9.5 with a nut. Oh, man. Yeah, and you know what? I'm going to go absolutely wild on this one. I'm going to go Whoa. full connoisseur, which I Whoa. am in no way uh, qualified to do. I'm giving this an 8.5. Oh, my God. Okay. Because I feel like it was like Ooh. mild in all ways. And if you wanted a mild treat, you're going to love this. But I like a more powerful flavor on things. That's funny. I thought it was very powerful. It was no. nice. It was no. like it had a powerful flavor, it but it didn't permeated it didn't, the mouth. Mm, but it but it didn't attack your mouth at all. It was just like very <laughs> nice. It was nice. And I'm not giving it, it, it uh, negative points for that. I'm saying that I I like a more powerful flavor. So if you want a more like powerful flavor, that's why you know what eight point five, eight point five. Melty Kiss Matcha. Ooh, Melty Kiss. I love Melty Kiss. A product of Tokyo. It's this little like greeny. Oh. Melty Kiss from oh, me. It. Melty young. kiss from Meiji or by Meiji. This limited edition chocolate can only be found during the winter in Japan. Delicately dusted with cocoa powder all over, this rich chocolate melts away the moment it hits your tongue, only to unearth the strong, careful notes of matcha. 
a magical combination of flavors, this milk chocolate will carry you from beginning to end with the smooth texture and taste. Oh Bam. my goodness. My God. This looks rich. Like, it is just a ball, a cube. Very, like, nicely done. Wow. Get that announcer voice on. Oh, is this whole one for me? Yeah, there are exactly three of them. Oh, I love that. Oof. It's kind of dusty and kind of shiny. Um, it smells really good. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, the presentation for me. Oh, so nice. Are lovely, you biting a lovely in half? chocolate smell? I'm gonna just eat the whole thing because I'm not on camera. I too will eat the whole thing. Mm -hmm. Look at that. And it's just like I said, rich. Mmm. Mmm. It's doing the melty part. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That was nice. Mm -hmm. That was very nice. Solid mm -hmm. eight for me. Mm -hmm. One of those treats. Mm. That again, this this falls much more into the, under the dark chocolate banner, mm. and that green tea flavor is really there and prominent in the mm. middle. It tastes very natural. I like mm. that a lot about it. Um, mm. Added sweetness the, didn't have the lingering bitter taste mm. uh, that I kind of expected. Now I'm like, you know, still tasting it in my mouth. Mostly the green tea. I like that a lot. Uh, I'm gonna follow the follow this under a seven point five though. <coughs> It's, really, it's rich, really rich. Have <clears throat> anything didn't like at all? Uh, for those guys, it was probably the 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 salmon cracker. Yeah, that was yeah. only okay. Uh, if they say it's only okay, that's like the Canadian way of saying it wasn't that great. Yeah, no, yeah. I, I, and even I still, like I it wasn't that great is a Canadian way of saying. Yeah, uh, you know? probably we actually can't say it legally. Yeah. We're Canadian in Canada. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <Not laughs> the either. Mounties come over here, eh? <laughs> yeah. Oh, I heard that a couple hosers were talking. I liked it though, but again, it's a very, it's an acquired taste. Yeah. Well, what's your number, my friend? Oh, for me, that was a nine, definitely. Oh, wow. It's cool. a quality, yeah, yeah, yeah. smooth, uh, smooth chocolate. Very yep. good. Very, yeah, very yeah. good. Very good. Very full-bodied flavor. It was, uh, the it next was, yeah. is a white strawberry, which looks like a little white swirly thing. Yeah. This, uh, oh, sorry, uh, from the Nagano oh Prefecture uh, by Kwa. I think we've had these Our, before. I think they were amazing. Kya. Oh my God, is it, it is the thing. I love Kwa. these so Anyways. much. This adorably sweet, or uh, this adorable sweet is actually the world's first chocolate infused strawberry made by innovative producer, excuse my pronunciation, but Kwa, Kwa, Q, Kwa, I don't know. How's it spelled? Q-U-A. Kwa. But, and then it's it's spelled, uh, it's spelled Q-A. Qua? Qua? Or, qua? Yeah, Qua. Qua. Qua? Qua? I don't know. Qua. I'm going to go with Qua. Made using Qua's special patented process. First, only the freshest organic strawberries are harvested from a local farm. Next, the, each strawberry is freeze dried to remove all the water, then infused with white chocolate. Finally, the strawberries are cooled, resulting in the perfect balance of smooth yet crunchy texture. See, so you look at it and you're like, what? Whoa. There's no chocolate in there, but it it's is. Infused. It's infused. Like, inside the strawberry. Enjoy the delicious combination of creamy chocolate sweetness and light strawberry tartness with each bite. Like, if you can get your hands on this, please get your yeah. hands on this. Oh my god, it's got a weight to it. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's a, <laughs> it is. It it's really a, does. A, a thick, thick girl, isn't she? Yeah. Because like, it's just so full, you know? Mm. So you might be like, boom, where's the chocolate? There's no chocolate. It's infused. If you bite it, I'm going to bite mine in half and do it a test. Mm -hmm. Oh. Mm. Mm. So, it feels like you're eating a chocolate. But it's a strawberry. But it's a strawberry, and it tastes amazing. It's just magic. It's like... You can't really... It's... <laughs> It's delicious. It's unbelievable. It's, it's delicious, but it's just, it's so weird. No. Like, imagine taking a Special K red berry cereal, mm. taking only the red berries out. Oh, my God. Soaking mm. the red berries in chocolate mm. and then refreeze drying them. And that's what it is. It's delightful. I love it. If those berries were real strawberries, I like the finest organic strawberries. Mm. Yeah. It's just so, mm. so this one smooth. Is a 10. I can't eat a lot of them, but I. No, I, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, the experience itself, I. I yeah. There's nothing. I have never eaten anything like this before. No, it is a totally unique thing. Previously. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna give it a nine 
Uh, only the only point it loses is that you can only eat so many of them because they're so rich and different. They're so different, like yeah, they're just interesting. So they're delicious. Mm -hmm. They're smooth. Too. They're uh, they're unexpected and and uh, yeah, I think that uh, I'm gonna give this a, a uh, glory to mankind. Gives me tingles. Mm. Oh, that was good. so delightful. I like it. I love <clears> it. Next one. Baked white chocolate. What? Get out of town. I'm in, I'm into it. <clears throat> I wonder if I could do like an epic meal time. That was my nickname in high school, by the way. Epic meal time? Baked no. white chocolate. Yeah. <laughs> it, 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 baked it white. Wasn't. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't. Don't worry. My nickname was, hey, you sissy boy. And Aww. then I'd be like, yeah? And they'd be like, why do you look like you're 12? And I'm Aww. like, I'm 17. You're really just explaining bullying right now. I am. Yeah. Packaged in a little muffin wrapper, this delicious white chocolate snack looks like as beautiful as snow and tastes even better. It's, it's joke, ingeniously guys. crafted to be crumbly, crunchy, and yet smooth with every bite. And also bacon strips, bacon strips, bacon strips. It's a joke, guys. Don't worry. Laugh about it. It's fine. Um, no, there's no bacon strips. The bacon strips part was a lie. Uh, but no, baked white chocolate and a little muffin wrapper. It sounds like, oh my god, it's adorable. Look, oh my god. <laughs> it's so cute. It doesn't look like a wagon wheel. Have you yeah. shown the people? I did. I, I showed them while you're explaining it. Look at it again. Look at that how cute it is. is. So adorable. I'll take like a quarter of it. I, I, th I think Yanni and I would be good with like a, a quarter. A half? Wow, this actually has some weight to it. Yeah. Well, here. They each, each have a half. I'll have a whole. That's great. I'll take a half. Sure. Yeah. Boom. Okay. So I'm, I'm, Ooh. I'm off. I'm like, I am, I'm hyping this up in my mind. It is white chocolate, which oh. is condensed milk. It's it baked. Have a much Look at the bottom it. of it. It kind of smells almost cheesy. Oh, it is definitely baked. <sighs> no, not cheesy. It just smells like milk. Hmm. Hmm. Mm. Oh, why is it clunky? Oh, this is nice. Uh, sells at work, I believe. So good. Mm. Studio Magane, by the way. Really great 8-bit remixes of all your favorite mm. animus. Mm. Just Subscribe to them. I think they hit, yeah, 100,000. Yeah, they hit 100,000 recently, so. They're so mm. good. Join mm. that army. Oh. It's good. Mm. This is really good. It's I can only eat that much, actually. Mm. I, I don't mm. think I can eat more than that. Woo! Mmm. Because I think like like this this for me is the so I, the, the, rapidly the, approaching levels of, of intolerably sweet. So it's a nine. Mm -hmm. It's still very good. Mm. It's like white chocolate sweet. Um, I would say it's like crumbly and crunchy. It had like little right? uh, bits of crunchiness. Like what's I, up with I, that? It was awesome. <clears throat> yeah, a little crunches. Actually, I'm gonna follow this up with. Mm. That's nice. That was it. Was quite good. Quite nice. good indeed. It was. Good. Uh, I'm gonna give that. Uh, so you Ooh. you give yours. You give yours. Oh, uh, it's a bit too sweet for me. Um, very, very powerful. Very sweet. <laughs> You're right. Uh, I was too generous. and eight is right. I was going to go with an eight. Yeah, eight makes sense. Yeah. That's a too sweet for me, dog. Delicious. Uh, no, I'm going a, I'm to a give this one for me. Like, I'm a sucker. That's a nine for sure. And I'm like happily, like I'm optimistic to give it a 9.25, 9.5. Ladies, like literally, like if you're out there and you're looking to cook your way into Tom's heart, all Ugh. you need to go do is go to Costco and just get the giant bag of sugar. Yeah. And basically yeah. throw that at him. Yeah. Like maybe, it's in my face. maybe you could like add some water and make it into like some sort of paste or put it in oh, an yeah. IV or something. That way, do that IV bag yeah. to my, uh, to my veins. Yeah, just, uh, just super delicious. Yeah. Hey, Big fan. Big and there fan. you go. I mean, and you, you win a Tom. <laughs> when a Tom, when a car. Tomo Rico corn sticks. Corn sticks. I don't know why corn sticks doesn't sound super appetizing. <laughs> but hey. <laughs> Whoa. This crisp and crunchy snack is made with famous Hokkaido sweet corn. The natural sweetness of the corn is all the sweetening this snack needs. Because corn's like pure sugar. <laughs> yeah. Uh, there's no added sugar here. Until recently, this snack could only be found in Hokkaido, but it's become so popular, you can now start finding it throughout Japan. Woo, interesting. Ooh. Do you think it's similar to like Jagariko? Jagariko. Jagariko. Oh, they look like snackoos. They look like snackoos. Oh, Jagariko. 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 Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm okay. I'll have two. So I'll give, one to, give, give two to the end. No, no, no. Oh, well, <laughs> rip, rip whatever that was. Rip that one. Thanks. No, there's, no, there's no smell to it. That smells like corn. Yeah, they're hilarious. Mm. 
<laughs> they, it's like you're eating a, it's they taste like corn. No way. It's like corn. No, this is gonna blow you guys' mind. Oh my it god. It tastes like corn. It's like <laughs> it tastes like cream corn. Like the definitive corn flavor. Yeah. Like there is nothing else but crunchy corn, and it's actually like really good. Like I, I like I, I I personally I don't like making and eating corn on the cob because it's uh, a little messy. Yeah. Although it's really easy to make. All you do is Yo. boil it and you butter it up. Yeah. What if we put butter and salt and pepper on this? Oh, man. Honestly, you could. I think the butter might be a little much. But no, salt it's and pepper. just like popcorn. Mm. Except it's corn sticks with butter. Mm. Yeah. Okay, guess oh, what? I love corn. That's why I love it. I love it too. It's really good. Mm. I could eat a lot of those. This is better than cheesies for me. Uh, yeah, better than cheesies. Mm. 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 Okay. Oh, my God. Mm -hmm. Like, I'm going to give that. I think uh, I eight. think there's a market for these in the West. Oh, yeah. yeah, like and corn is like really cheap too, from what I've heard. It is there. The Just cheapest. ask Nebraska. Yeah, <laughs> um, I'm gonna give it uh, like a seven point five. It was tasty. I would eat a bunch of it, but it w didn't have a differentiator to me to put it into that it top wasn't, bracket. Wasn't special. Yeah, it wasn't special. Like it, it was specially oh, corn was flavored. But what uh, do you I'll give it an eight as well. I, I felt like, yeah, it's a good snack. Yep. It was, like, a, little, I think it was a little about... corny. <laughs> oh, man. So was that joke. Hey, oh. Oh. The last one, the final, the finale is the milk, 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 mochi, mochi, mochi from the Nigata Prefecture. Uh, from Echigo Seika. Um, light as air and snow white, milk mochi look like puffy snowflakes. From the same maker as fan favorite Kinako Mochi, this variety features a Hokkaido milk coating. Slightly sweet and creamy, this delicious snack may is made using domestic Japanese mochi rice and a secret process to transform it into the crisp and airy texture of this cloud-like confection. Ooh, it smells really oh, sweet. Oh, it smells really sweet and really good. Ooh. I grabbed you a good one. Yeah, mine has like a butt on it. I already got oh, one. Oh, you got one? Oh yeah. my god. Didn't you forget the little orange candies? Oh! Yeah, the little right. orange candies. We'll, we'll, the we'll, we'll swing back to those. You are correct. Man, what's that smell like? It smells like condensed milk. Mm hmm. Oh. That's so weird. I, get, I, I just eat a whole bag, feel weird about it the whole time. Huh. It disappeared in my mouth. Yeah, that's a but it was kind of like cold in places, right? Mm -hmm. That was interesting. Mm -hmm. That's a seven for me. Not bad, like not bad by any means. But very uh, interesting. Yeah, interesting. Very interesting. A, a, a seven point five, a seven point interesting I'm, I'm need, five. I'm need one more. I know, because you you know what it is. There's like no after flavor. It, like none none of what it is is leads into the after flavor. It just kind of has another bit of a lingering taste. It's totally different. So it's like, wait, what was that? What did I just put in my mouth? I forgot what I just put in my mouth. Oh, I forgot what I just put in my mouth <laughs> every time. Uh, uh, I'm definitely going to eat those while I'm gaming. So I think there's a win on that one. But uh, yeah, that, that's good. I'll go with the 7.5. Yeah, I think um, that, that fits that way. Uh, I must run away. Uh, I have an audition, but I was able to get through all the all the treats minus this. So I want to pop this open. We already read that this was. Uh, <clears throat> no, we did not. Oh, I only read the title. This delicious last one, homemade Mikan candy. I think Mikan, are they uh, the oranges. mandarin oranges? Yeah. Mm. I guess little sweet oranges, uh, I guess, those little ones. They're uh, like clementines. Clementines. Is this delicious citrus candy is made with Mikan juice, a winter citrus fruit related to the tangerine. Only, I guess Mikan's are slightly different. My Only dear. natural flavoring is used, which lets the pure flavor of the tangy fruit shine through. Mikan is one of the most popular winter fruits in Japan, and it's often featured in Japanese New Year celebrations since they ripen at just the right time. Before you go, give us a number. Yeah, no, I'm going to. I, I, I've been, I've been thinking on this. Uh, I'm going to give this one an 8.5. Because gosh, deadly dang darn, is it delicious? Uh, actually, reminds me of almost like orange Tic Tacs, but more natural flavoring. The only reason that it loses a couple points is the actual uh, journey to my mouth. It's such a hard candy, you just have to suck on it for about an hour. That's why I like uh, it. So I'm going to run away. Whoop. See y'all at mm. Kingdom Hearts tonight. Oh, this is nice. Mm. 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 A little sharp. Very sharp. <laughs> but uh, very nice. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> is this uh, Hayore or what, what was it? Naruko? Song? Love is a remember. servant of chaos. Nyaruko, crawling with love. Nyaruko. Um, damn. Well, Tom is not going to uh, 
I'm not going to be able to give us a whole rating on the box, but check out this. Check out this whole spread here. That's a nice spread. So I'm going to give this... I love this. This mm. is really good. Me too. I'm going to give it like a 9. As far as like hard candies go, yeah, I'm, I'm going to give it a 9. Mmm. 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 I love this. Mmm. All right. So, box on the whole, delicious as usual. I think I liked last month's box better. Oh, really? I think so. Um, I can't remember last month's box that well. Remember how just how, like, everything was just like, whoa, whoa, whoa. Mmm. Oh, 8-Bit Sora Yori. Might do, actually. Let me go to the channel. Studio Megane. That's Studio Megane with two A's. Megane. Um, um, so. Um, to be. I think I'm gonna give this whole box an eight. Uh, ten. I liked it a lot, as usual. It's always uh, a unique and different experience. I'm gonna give it a... Well, that fish cracker brings it down a lot. So I'm gonna say, you know what? An eight is a good number. It's gonna. You be know what's funny eight. about the the fish cracker though? Like, I, I'll tell you right now, it's gonna be like a love it or hate it thing. Yes, you absolutely. Know? Like, it's it's totally personal preference. It's still a very high quality like thing. So if you're into like those like powerful fish flavors, um, it's for you. If not, then it's not for you. <laughs> but yeah, because I, I feel like that's one you could like give to a bunch of your friends like in the West here, and not many of them would like it. No. We're not well, sorry, in Vancouver, though, we have, we have a, a high Asian uh, population, which is why you can find, like, similar-ish snacks, and, mm. and they would probably like it a lot. Um, but, yeah, I guess it's just what you're used to and what you're brought up with. <clears throat> These McCann candies are so good. So, really um, delicious. Highly recommend boxes. Um, there's the Nyan 5 code. You can use it in the link to uh, get your very own for January, because January is shaping up to be a pretty damn good box as well. Limited edition. Uh... Yeah, with the cool looking cover. With the cool looking white box. So. Super duper good. I have to make a thumbnail for Kingdom Hearts because I forgot this morning. Mmm. I made thumbnails for other things but forgot Kingdom Hearts. Well, we should do that. Yeah. <laughs> Wouldn't it be fun to live stream uh, thumbnail creation? No, because then you just see how <laughs> horrible my, um, my, method? my methods are. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Works in Microsoft Paint. It's incredible. <laughs> um yeah new tier sponsorship is an update video it's not very concise but it was a lot of fun it was um, a lot of fun you guys are crazy i can't thank you guys enough uh absolutely incredible we're gonna be playing three five over two right after this and uh freaking yeah um we're gonna be doing um a nyan rewind a little year in the review uh sometime which i'm You'd... probably gonna cry oh probably yeah It'd be a lot of fun you just talk about the year that, that could be like a five hour stream oh my god oh so man fun like i'm sure people have a lot like we might even have plans for new year's but it'd be so cool to like count down the new year while doing that oh my god right Why tom would, would never allow it though <laughs> <laughs> he's just so popular that he's guy. so popular but absolutely incredible amazing super duper wow fantastic um this yeah. box was good it's good it was good I, I i like this box i like boxu i i like i like things ah thanks for eating forever I'll props cry. We're all gonna cry. We're gonna have a good cry. Uh, maybe we'll do it like the day before New Year's. Like, we'll, 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 we'll get into your schedule. Have your people call my people, and we'll we'll figure it out. Okay. See, the thing about crying is it's hard to cry if you keep on doing memes. So <laughs> maybe I'll just meme it up, and we'll have like um, whenever anything happens, just that takes you to the cry moment, doesn't it? Like that time you ruined a trailer. I know. I feel like... <laughs> I'm just kidding. You didn't. You uh, did. It was really funny. It was really funny. Uh, I, I did it for the memes. Honestly, if you offended half of the people, then it was a good joke. Because the other half will defend you. If, if you, I've if... offended half the people, man, hopefully that's everything that comes out of my mouth. Just kidding. I don't want to offend people. I lied. It was a lie. I don't... I take it back. Put it back in there. Put it back in there. <laughs> we'll, just, we'll have like a cry face cape where I'm going to send pictures of their crying faces. Oh... Ugly cry. We can call it the Claire Danes cave. Oh. Or the uh, the Hanakawa cave. Yeah. Yeah. But Claire Danes is known for her ugly cry face. Nice. Okay. 
anyways, it's been fun. Get your own box suit. They're awesome. I recommend them. <laughs> get your own. Get your own. Get your suit. own box suit. What's considered an ugly cry? When you can like kind of not make out what your face originally looked like. <laughs> or what it's supposed to look like. Just Google Claire Danes cry. Um, <laughs> that's Claire Danes cry. You know what? Let's just get my window up here. I think I have it still here. Where is it? Oh, she's not that bad. Claire oh my god. <laughs> oh no. Yeah, that one face is pretty good. Is it here? Yeah, there it is. Nice. Oh god, this scene is messy. The scene is really messy. A lot going on. All right. Anyways, uh, we're out of here. It's been absolutely super duper real. And we'll see you very soon. Yeah, I need to make a thumbnail. So bye. Bye. Look at that. She's she was my big crush from uh, Romeo and Juliet. <laughs> You'd be nice to her forever because you wouldn't want to see her cry. Like you just literally wouldn't want to see her cry. Yeah. <laughs> Look at that. She's such a good like, I mean, the thing is, she does not hold back. And that's the thing about being a good actor is you just don't don't ever hold anything back ever. What if you're acting as someone who holds back though? Yeah, but she doesn't <laughs> ever. She goes she puts everything in there. I'm afraid that there might be a boob though, so we're just gonna Alright, let's get out of here. Okay, bye. Bye!